How you doing there? I'm good. I have alcohol, so. Me too. All right, let's get into it. Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions, you idiots. I'm Corbin. Me llamo Steve Cardo. And today we are on to episode four getting right through this series and there's only seven so we actually only have four left right wow yeah yep. this including this one four left um which is the shortest series i believe we've ever reacted to but last episode was fan yeah. fantastic it ended with a very stupid uh thing by the police <laughs> uh by crossing a river and only one person who can't swim is holding the prisoner uh, crossing a river that's not handcuffed. Uh, so strange. Uh, <laughs> and and then and then calling for him. Yes. Uh, so I believe. Where is in America? Where is in America? We don't call for you. We shoot you in the back. Yeah. Not. Neither. <laughs> N neither are great neither of those extremes <laughs> is the right way to go about it ladies and gentlemen uh but i believe our our lead to the dcp is going to be very upset by that fact uh <laughs> i don't think she's gonna take that all I, I, too I well think she's gonna be yeah no uh she's gonna say i should have sent some women out to get the job done absolutely so anyways uh, if you'd like to see uh, once again we can only use five minutes of cut-up footage from each episode for each reaction. I would like to use more. I cannot. So, uh, I'm assuming if you're here on the fourth episode, you've been here for one through three. Uh, so, you know that. If you'd like to see the full uncut reactions, go check them out on Patreon for our exclusive Patreon babies. Uh, the link is in the pinned comment and the description below. You ready? Yeah. Three, two, Three. one. Each time... Yeah, it's kind of. It would be very it's, inappropriate. Yeah, it's yeah. a little inappropriate to like put some suspense on it, you know. Yeah, I thought about that last episode. I thought if they had done that opening scene where the rapist confessed what he did and then like did a close up on her and then cut to the opening, it would be like. Yeah, yeah, it's best that no. they did the, the way they did. This is this is too evil a story and too serious a story, that, and I I just they've. They've done a magnificent job handling this material the right way. Absolutely. Ma'am, Amar Singh mil gaya. Great. Wow, he stayed? That's a shock. <laughs> Did that actually happen? Like, he swam away and then he was like, I so. okay, I guess not. That's, I, I guess. that's weird. That is weird. That's so freaking weird. I meant to say this earlier, I love this show isn't so much a fly on the wall as much as it makes you feel like a participant in the investigation. You feel like you're walking yeah, yeah. with everybody. Yeah, Bhaskar Kumar Gaon. Yeah. Yeah, he's building a... ...ka bus stand sa ek bus mein chadha, jahan shay logo ne us par hamla kiya. Hamle ke baad usse loot kar, usse mark kar fake diya gaya. Hodge khas aur Orbindo mark ki crossing ko. Bakila. This is a pattern. Or ek Sibji ki murti thi dashboard par. Wow. Register a case against the same suspects. It's the same gang, too. Sure seems like it. It's so all of them playing. It was, it was all him. He was, had the idea. If I had complained about that night, then maybe we could have prevented this. Mm. Great line. What's wrong with her? So is this what you meant when you said you'd show me the good side of daddy? Yikes. Mm. Yikes. Yikes. Wow. Oh, truth, man. Why well, do I feel it's like when they transported Joker like, in the Dark Knight? I no. I know. I feel like so it's the same way. In India, do you have a right to an attorney? Just like you do in the United States? I don't know. Oh, my lord. Take a minute. 
ये सर उसके पुराने मालिक का नंबर है एक बार देख लो अगर इससे कुछ मदद मिल जाए आपको तो The lighting in that was so flat and generic. It was awesome. It felt so real. Can your dad show me? Bitch! She's just like her mom. Fiery. I like it. Yeah, I like it. What even is this? I think this. He said the public interest. This is. Like the case is not even done. This isn't this is about them being responsible for it even having happened in the first place because they're failing to police properly. What an absolute waste of time. To make the politicians look good. Hey. <laughs> awesome. Come on, let's go. We almost got arrested there. Remember? Yep. Rohan. What? Why no tanks and tear gas for a peaceful protest? That's weird. Yeah, really, they're underarmed. <laughs> Americans. Yeah, it ain't just us. <laughs> you raped and mutilated a woman, and you expect any sympathy at all? No. Coronavirus test. A couple of stupid babies in there for sure. Okay, bye. Bye, Guys will never have to know what that feels like. No, you never. You're never concerned for your safety when you just walk out. Good pen, Jod. Oh, madam. Us rat bus me. The boyfriend. Look at his girlfriend. But his girlfriend to the pick eye. No, she isn't. I knew he was sketchy. Knew it. Mm. Yep. Knew there was something wrong with him. Something was off. Yeah, he he Wow. So yeah, our suspicions are are accurate that just a which is a great job for them to make us feel that way without doing anything cliche with his character to indicate yeah yeah, yeah. absolutely um, really, really well done very well written um that's wow. crazy that well I, I thought it was coming but the, the fact that there's another layer to this so he, she was we yeah. thought Dapika was his girlfriend, but he did he hunt her basically to to bring her to his gang to Yeah. I I have felt I have felt from the beginning when he wasn't hurt as badly. Yeah. And the fact that he was that like cause it, he because if I was in his shoes, I would not be alive. Uh or they would be dead. One of the two. Like Right, uh, right, I, I, and like I said before, what I what I think happened was I think he was part of the plan. He lured her yeah. and brought her to the bus, and things went farther than he was thinking they would go. And when he tried to stop it, the driver that everybody says is so mean beat the living crap out of him, but didn't hurt him too bad, uh, and threw him out of the bus. Yeah, that's my suspicion. Yeah. And, um, and then obviously with the whole news thing, which is ridiculous, uh, and I'm assuming it's true because I don't know why they would put it in this if it's not. Um, but I mean that happens everywhere. I mean we we have an entire news channel here that's based on fake news. Uh, <laughs> yes. So it's not it's not something that's like far out of left field. <laughs> I 100% uh, no, and we've heard it. believe uh, news stations would do something like that. Yeah, and we've heard widespread corruption exists at all levels of the justice system, whether it's the politicians or the police or media who needs to accurately report facts. Yeah. Um, and uh, two things that really stuck out to me. The first one is 
that this depicts, and I'm assuming it's true, the fact, the truth, that in the midst of a corrupt situation, there are still good people trying to do the right thing. Yeah. Uh, and, the, you know, some of these, these cops, especially her, she said something that was really important. And this is for, we mentioned this in the last reaction, for any of you beautiful, stupid babies who either have been raped or know someone who's been raped, but especially if you have been raped and haven't told anybody about it. I know it's not easy. I can only imagine. I can't, I can't empathize. I could only sympathize with the plight, especially when you can get blamed for it. You can be shamed for it and eventually see no justice happen to the perpetrators. However, being silent will absolutely mean no justice. And if they did it to you, they'll do it to another girl. And you're talking about it might prevent that from happening. If you're silent, it absolutely 100% won't stop it. And, but you could potentially stop it. And for friends and family to be supportive of that person and not like this whole thing that it's their fault or they'll bring shame on your family. That's so fucking stupid. Uh, <laughs> um, taking something that traumatic happened and making it something about you. Um <sighs> Um, so it makes no sense, but always be supportive of, uh, cause I think there was like a, a survey, uh, at least in the United States done that, like, if you're in a room of women and you ask, have you been affected by sexual harassment or worse? Almost every single woman will a hundred percent raise their hand, right? All of them will raise their hand. And yeah. I do believe the statistic is one in four women. Have either been raped or molested. Yeah, but every woman has experienced sexual yeah. something, sexual harassment, uh, se like something like that. Yeah, it's like it's like why are you even asking? I asked that of of my daughters yeah. who are in their early twenties, and they're like, uh, "Yeah, I can't even count the number of times I've had something inappropriate said or done toward me. Nothing criminal has been done to them, but they have absolutely experienced. I've seen it." It's ridiculous, yep. but we, we are here for you. We support you and, uh, we, we love you. Absolutely. Um, but yeah, fantastic yep. show. Um, it's getting, it's getting crazier and I'm, I'm looking forward to finding out what actually happens. Hopefully justice is served, but I don't know with, with all the politicians <sighs> involved and that's always unfortunate, but on to the next episode. Da <laughs> <laughs>